One, two, three, go. One, two, three, go. See what I used to blend a gusi. I broke my blender, my big blender. I was using it to blend beans for moi moi and it just fell from my hand and got broken, like shattered. And today I was just craving for a gusi soup. I was thinking, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? I remember this. If you watch my Temo haul, you will know this. Surprisingly, look at, like, he crushed it. He crushed the Ogusi. I'm like, what? This thing is so strong. Like, see, just like this, after charging it. Look at every home needs this in case of emergency days like this i'm yet to go outside and get another blender but see imagine if this thing is not in my kitchen eh what would i have done like what would i have done i decided to show you people go and use my link and order your own it's so cheap <laughs> ciao ciao my precious ciao ciao Mm. So yummy, guys. Come on, it's come. Mm.
the hair I made for Emela. Emela is not allowing me to do this video. We are going out today, Saturday. I want to go out and get some things I need for myself, for Emela, and around the house. So we are going out. It's a beautiful Saturday. I can see the kids playing downstairs, our neighbor's kids. And the weather is not too hot. And it's not, in fact, it's a perfect weather. And I don't have much to do. I only made Emela say, guys, I'm so proud of myself. See, I can make her not like perfect, perfect, perfect professional. The only issue I have is Emela will not allow me. But today, we managed to make something different from our normal, our usual. I'm so happy. I'm so proud of myself. Look at how she's sitting like a lady. Hi. Are you going outside? Mama, come down. Come. Go to Kurugadiro where I know ya. Okay. Mama, let's go. See your clothes. Come, Mama, where are you going? Come. Come and pick clothes for yourself. Come. Don't put it. No, you don't put it in your mouth. Life is but a dream. Roll, roll, roll your boat gently down the stream. Merry, 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 Life is but a dream. Roll, roll, roll your boat gently down the stream. Good job. Hi, girl. Yes. Yes.
knock, knock. If anyone hear my voice, if anyone hear my voice, I will open. Permission, man. See, Mama, this was the gift bag you received from yesterday in church. Are you ready to open it? I take. Take. Uh, let's open. Let's see what is inside. Wow! Mika chips. Mama, come. Baby Kamamila. Wow. Mama, you have juice. Mama, come and take your juice. Let's see what you have. Wow, pencil! Oh, a sharpener to sharpen your pencil. And you have some sweets. Mama, take. It's all yours. Wow, say thank you. Thank you, I appreciate my gift. See your juice. Wow. You want to... Bless you, baby. Bless you. Oh, see, you have pencil. You're going to use it and write. You love writing, right? See, see sharpen up. You use it to sharpen your pencil. Wow. Now, see, see sweet. I say thank you. Thank you. I appreciate my gift. God bless you all. I love my gift. No, don't write on my table. Thank you to all mommies, aunties that reached out to me on my last, I think last two or three videos regarding sleep training Chimemela. Like after I made that video, a lot of you people reached out, shared uh, some tips that can help me, which I'm trying them out now. And some even came to Instagram. Thank you so much. One of the mommies reached out and she suggested, she dropped it in the comment section, that we should try and enroll mama, start school for her. Like what she's saying is actually true because, like I shared it in one of my videos, one of my husband's colleague, an Italian woman, she's a mother, she also told my husband that when she starts school that she's going to start sleeping well and my younger sister experienced it although her kids don't struggle with sleeping but her baby started school and the first day the baby went to school a baby boy he came back and he was sleeping throughout and my sister called me and was like oh, come oh, come and see what is happening this boy has been sleeping since they came back from school so i feel like that is going to help we went to one of the school close to us that was a few months ago to see if they can take her but that was not because of sleeping or anything that period we noticed that she wanted to be outside she wanted going out like you hear her saying outside but they told us that when we came registration was over for the new section that we should wait which I understand because the proper time for her to start school here in Italy is three years. We wanted to see even if it's two days in a week, just something that will take her out to, you know, play, mix with other kids. But it did not work because the registration was over by the time we went there. And another thing, the woman asked if I was working, like going out every day and i said no my work is from the house so she said i should just relax try and engage her and at the moment i'm really engaging her after this video i'm going to take her downstairs to walk around 
after giving her her breakfast, batting her sometimes we go outside, walk around our neighborhood just to allow her you know busy on some days when the daddy is a bit free after work he used to take her out they would play go to the park ride bicycles sometimes so we are trying to engage her while we wait for mama what is it while we wait for next year september so we have tried starting school for her even if it's two days in a week not like every every day but it didn't work because the time we went there was late and everywhere was occupied i'm trying my best yes i'm not done talking and i'm trying to you know engage her like i said more in activities it's getting better it will always get better i'm not scared i know that it's something that will pass it's a season that will pass so i'm not worried about it. it's just that sometimes it can be stressing tiring but we are grateful we are not complaining I can't wait for next year not i can't wait i'm enjoying this period i'm not rushing anything but i'm looking forward to next year when she will start school and school run start so for now guys i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog life of a nigerian wife living abroad doing her thing i'm grateful i'm happy for every season of my life like subscribe if you haven't shared and i'm going to see you in the next one i look sleepy i'm a kind of but i know why i'm feeling like this i'm going to go and rest maybe after taking her outside for now bye i have seen the lord's good